guys, it's Billy here in the Chelsea neighborhood of Manhattan. You know, I don't know about you, but certain questions keep me up at night. For instance, do you think Taylor Swift's vagina smells like fruit by the foot? And are there any black people who watch Mad Men? Which brings me to my next question, which is also the name of our next game. Are you smarter than a gay fifth grader? Let's play. Okay, guys, out here, ready to play. Are you smarter than a gay fifth grader? We've got two great contestants. We have a fifth grader here. What is your name, sir? Oliver. Oliver, and where are you from? Bridgewater, New Jersey. Okay, and do you like pop culture, Oliver? Yes, I do. Okay, and we have another lovely contestant here. We just met on 23rd Street. What is your name, miss? Anita. Anita, and what do you do in New York? Um, nothing. Okay, great. And do you watch Mad Men? Yes. You do? Yes, yeah. Oh, wow, there's a black person who watches Mad Men. You love John Hamm? No. Okay, great. Here we go. Okay, here's how it works. I'm going to ask you 10 quick multiple choice questions. You have to buzz in and tell me the right answer. Please don't answer before you buzz in, and don't answer before I read all the answer options. Whoever gets the most right out of 10 questions wins a, wins a big prize. Some of the questions are subjective. For those, your answer has to match my answer, my opinion. Do you understand? Yes. Do you understand? Yes. Okay, here we go. Anita versus Oliver. And away we Go. Which is a better movie, Step Brothers or Step Mom? Uh, Oliver. Step Brothers. Yes, correct. Who is a better actor, Jim Carrey or Orlando Bloom? Uh, Oliver. Jim Carrey. Yes, correct. Which group is more horrifying, the KKK or the Black Eyed Peas? Uh, Anita. Black Eyed Peas. Uh, no, the KKK. Oliver gets the point. Who's more interesting, Casey Affleck or Casey Anthony? Uh, Oliver. Uh, Casey Affleck. No, Casey Anthony. Wrong. Anita gets the point. Who's more exhausting, Lady Gaga or Katy Perry? Uh, Oliver. Katy Perry. No, Lady Gaga, incorrect. Which George Clooney movie did I understand? Syriana or The Ides of March? Uh, Oliver. Uh, the Ides of March. Yes, correct. Should anyone other than a gay tween still be watching Glee, yes or no? Uh, Oliver. No. Yes, correct. Uh, who's more talented, Kesha or Tori Spelling? Uh, Oliver. Kesha. <laughs> yes, correct, Kesha. Who will die first, Michael Bublé or Josh Groban? Uh, Anita. Josh Bublé. No, Michael Bublé, who wins? Oliver. Oliver wins! Yes, congratulations, yes. Oliver! And here you go, here's your prize. It's a sled! Yes! There you go! Thank you so much! You excited about your sled? Yes, I am! Okay, bye guys, we'll be right back. Hey guys, it's Billy Eichner, and this is Funnier Die's Billy on the Street, a new music and pop culture trivia game show. Now, before we get to the big three round games, let's hit the streets and see what New Yorkers have to say. Here we go. Sir, Sir Rooney Mara. Charles. Huh? Chuck. Who the hell's Chuck? I don't know, some black guy from New York City. That's you? That's me. Well, what about Rooney Mara? Who's Mara? She's the girl with the dragon tattoo. Don't know her. She's the hottest actress right now. Really? Yes. She's very sexy. Yeah, I, well, I believe you. Yes. You didn't read the book? No. You're not a Steve Larson fan? No. Oh, my God. What movie have you seen lately? Um, Season of the Witch. What the hell? Season of the Witch? Was Nicolas Cage in that? Yes. Oh, God. No. No. Miss, any thoughts on Brad Pitt? <laughs> Do you like him? Yes, he's a good actor. He's good. But that's about it. And he, in his younger days, he was very good looking. He's kind of losing it now. OK, thank you very much. What singer do you like? Well, new band. They're called Revolver. That I've started listening to. I don't want to hear about anything right, new. On, no, no new bands. No new bands. Who do I like? Was that some indie band? Was your boyfriend in it? No, they're French. And they're great. Oh, they're okay. absolutely great. Adele? Do you like Adele? I, I do like Adele. Adele's pretty cool. We missed her in Dallas because she got pneumonia. Oh, this is such a good story. Yeah, no, it's OK, thank you. Miss, what kind of music you listen to? Uh, everything. Who's your favorite singer right now? Adele? No, I would say Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift, wow. You're a big Taylor Swift fan? Yes. Wow. She's very young. She is. Yeah, she sings about, like, having boyfriends in high school and stuff. Oh, but I like her voice. Really? Do you hear her sing live, though? No. It's not that great. No? <laughs> I like, I like um, groups like El Devo as well. Oh, El Devo, yeah. Michael Bublé. Yes. Oh, yeah. Would you like to have a three-way with Michael Bublé and Josh Groban? Oh, please. Don't ask such a personal question. But you would. Da ha. Not saying a word. Maybe. Not saying a word. It's all over your face. <laughs> You're bad. Have a nice day. Thank you. You too. Okay, thank Bye. you. Bye.
Because I can arrange it. Oh, yeah. Okay, all right. What is your name? Michaela. And you are what? A future actress. Oh, really? And, and what roles would you like to do? Horror, comedy, um, basically anything. I just love to act. I go to theater school. Oh, yeah, wow. We, we, all, yeah. we go to Bronx yeah. Theater High School. Where do you go? We go to Bronx, Bronx Theater High School. It's like Kennedy. It's what? It's Inside Kennedy. Kennedy. But I'm like the number one actress. Like I'm gonna be a future and I'm actress. I'm a dancer. Oh. oh, you're a dancer? Yeah. And so, we're steppers. So, what? Yes, we're steppers. You're what? Steppers. Oh, can you do a little? Oh, sure. Oh, yes. And Ready? Go. Here we go. And go. Figure it out. <laughs> step. 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 Hey. I'm the best actress! Hey guys, it's Billy out here in front of Columbus Circle, ready to play one of my favorite games, Rebecca Black or Black Person. I'm gonna give this contestant a fact, and she has to tell me whether it refers to Rebecca Black or a famous black person. If she gets 10 right in 45 seconds, she wins a big prize. What's your name, miss? Shay. Shay? Yeah. Shay, and where were you going right now? Oh, I'm going to drop off a hard drive. Oh, wow, that's fascinating. Okay, you ready to play Rebecca Black or black person? Yep. Here we go. Put 45 seconds on the clock, please. And away we go. Sings Friday. Rebecca Black. Correct. Start in the movie Friday. Black person. Yes, appears as herself in the Katy Perry video for last Friday night. Rebecca Black. Correct. She led more than 300 fugitive slaves to freedom on the Underground Railroad. Black person. Yes, correct. Had a YouTube video featuring four actors paid to play her friends wave to her in a car. Rebecca Black. Correct. Went to jail after fighting to end 46 years of apartheid. Black person. Correct. Sang the lyrics, gotta have cereal. Black person? No, Rebecca Black ah. was assassinated five years after giving the historic I Have a Dream speech. MLK, black person. Yes, correct. I don't care about the details. Had her song Friday covered on Glee. Rebecca Black. Correct. Wrote, I know why the caged bird sings. My Angelou Black person. Yes, correct. Went on Good Morning America and expressed a desire to duet with Justin Bieber. Rebecca Black. Yes, correct. <laughs> Winner! Yes, Shay! Yes, Shay, with all your fancy details inserted. Let's see her prize. Oh, it's a pair of shoes! Congratulations! Thank you. They are nice. They're beautiful. Thank you very much, Shay. Thanks for playing Rebecca Black or Black person. We'll be right back. Shay, everyone! Yes! Good job. Thanks. Do I have to keep these? Yes, you do. Okay. Goodbye. Bye. Bye, Shay. Good luck with everything. Oh, a lot of dots. Certainly likes a dot. Thanks, Shay. Enjoy those shoes. Ugh. Nancy, what the hell do you want to do? I guess that's ask an Asian. Really? Okay, guys, now it's time for a segment I like to call Quizzed in the Face. Here's how it works. There are three rounds of trivia questions. If you get two questions wrong in the first two rounds, you're out, but you have three chances to ask for help if you don't know the answer. In the third round, you're on your own. And remember, the final round in this game show is subjective, so in order for a contestant to win, we have to share the same opinions about pop culture. Let's play. Miss! Miss, you want to play the new Funny or Die game show? You can win real money right now. It's real fast. What's your name? Nancy. Nancy, what are you listening to? Uh, Adele. Adele, she's very good. Rolling in the deep. Totally. Have you ever seen the video for Rolling in the Deep? No. She's sitting in the chair the whole time. Rolling. No, she's not rolling. She's, she's, not she's, ro she's just sitting. She's sitting in the chair. She's, she has the biggest album of the year. Get the hell up! Here we go. Ready? Here's how it works. If you get two questions wrong, you're out. If you need help answering a question, you can beg a stranger, ask an Asian, or call a woman. Are you ready? Sure. Here we go. Round one, question one for $25. Before Katy Perry, what band had a song called California Girls? A, the California Raisins. B, Bon Jovi. C, the Beach Boys. D, the Beach Guys. Or E, Beach Douche. Oh, should be Beach Douche, but it's Beach Boys. Yes, correct, Nancy! Here you go. Question two, Nancy. In Twilight, what mythical animal does Taylor Lautner turn into? A, someone who sees Drew Barrymore movies in the theater. B, a werewolf. C, woolly mammoth. D, gerbil. Uh, werewolf. You sure? I'm hoping, because you... I haven't seen the movie. Oh, you haven't seen it? Yeah. You're sorry. lucky. They're awful. I'm sorry. But you're correct, Nancy! Yes, werewolf! Wonderful. Question three. Here we go. Still in the game. Yeah. Anthony Weiner resigned from office after he was caught tweeting pictures of his A, Carrie Underwood, B, Maroon 5, C, Little Big Town, D, Reba McIntyre, E, his Jewish groin. 
I'm gonna go with Jewish grind. You are correct, Nancy! Yay! Here we go, you just won 25 bucks. Awesome. Into round two for 50 bucks. Here we go. Okay. Question one. The Beatles song, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, is falsely rumored to be about what popular 60s drug? A, LSD, B, cocaine, C, peyote, D, chipotle. Uh, LSD. Are you sure? Yeah. You wanna ask an Asian? Um, not today. Have you ever asked an Asian anything? Once or twice. They know. They do. You are correct! It's yeah. LSD, Nancy! Okay, question two. Here we go. Madonna is partnering with her daughter, Lourdes, in what type of business? A, fashion line. B, tobacco farm. C, cougar town. D, fame addiction. Oh, I don't know. Do you want to beg a stranger? Sure. Let's go! Let's go! Come on, Nancy! Let's go! Let's go! Miss! Miss, miss, I need your help. I need your help. I need your help. Nancy needs help answering a question for money. Okay. Ready? Here we go. You're on the new Funnier Die game show. Here we go. This is for Nancy. What's your name? Liza. You look like Eliza. <laughs> okay, here. Madonna is partnering with her daughter, Lourdes, in what type of business? A, fashion line. B, tobacco farm. C, cougar town. D, fame addiction. A, fashion line. Are you sure? I'm sure. Do you accept Liza's Thank answer? I do. I do. Thank you. You got it! Yes! Yes! Nancy continues. Bye, Liza. Bye. Where are you going? I'm going to the subway. Okay, sounds fun. <laughs> right. Okay, bye. You're probably going to see a homeless person. Okay, here we go. Question three. If you get this right, you're on to round three, the subjective round. Oh, my Lord. For $50. Beyonce announced her pregnancy by A, constantly dancing and performing, B, telling reporters on the red carpet at the VMAs, C, ordering Kelly Rowland to prepare her breasts for feeding and learn how to assemble a crib, or D, this has nothing to do with the question, but Jay-Z's mouth is literally the biggest thing I've ever seen. It's kind of, I think it's the last one about Jay-Z's mouth, yeah. No. What is your answer? Um, wasn't it, wasn't it the tweet? Wait. Uh, Nancy, make a choice. You want to ask an Asian, what the hell do you want to do? I guess that's ask an Asian. Really? Oh, Jesus, here we go. We gotta ask an Asian. We gotta ask an Asian. Oh, my God. Miss, she looks Asian enough. Miss, 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 she needs help answering your questions for money. It's real fast and you look Asian enough. Yes, here we go. Here we go. Beyonce, you know Beyonce? Yes. Okay, what's your name? Rita. Rita. Okay, Beyonce, uh, Rita, Nancy, 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 get in the shot. Jesus Christ. Here we go. Beyonce, don't look at my questions. Beyonce announced her pregnancy by A, constantly dancing and performing, B, telling reporters on the red carpet at the VMAs, C, ordering Kelly Rowland to prepare her breasts for feeding and learn how to assemble a crib, or D, this has nothing to do with the question, but Jay-Z's mouth is literally the biggest by thing I've dancing. ever seen. What? By dancing. Constantly dancing and performing? Yes. Do you agree with Rita? No, it's B. It's VMAs. What? B, VMAs. Yes, you are right, Rita. You're worthless. Get the hell out of here. Nancy, goodbye, Rita. Okay, here we go, Nancy. You're moving on to the subjective round. Round three, you can double your money again. Here's how the subjective round works, though. You can double your money and win $100 if and only if your answer matches my answer, my opinion. Do you understand, Nancy? So think about me while you get quizzed in the face. Which one of these Perrys would I rather have lunch with? A, Katy Perry, B, Matthew Perry, C, Tyler Perry, D, Perry Gilpin, Roz on Frasier. Uh, Katy Perry. Why do you say Katy Perry? She seems like a lot of fun. I mean, and it seems like you'd have plenty of fodder to mock. She wears interesting things. Yeah, she wears candy and Fruit Loops and stuff. Yeah, yeah, and has cupcakes on her boobs and shit. But I'm sorry. No, the answer is Perry Gilp and Roz from Fraser. Katy Perry's so fake. Yeah. She's exhausting. She's biting off Lady Gaga. Lady Gaga's biting off Madonna. I don't need that. Just give me a nice casual sandwich and a glass of white wine with Perry Gilp and from Fraser. I'm gonna give you one more chance. Okay. Are you ready? But this is it. All right. I'm serious. Okay. Here we go, Nancy. You're Jewish, yeah? No. Really? Mm hmm Just Middle Eastern flavor. Italian. Sicilian. That's not Middle Eastern. And it's like Mediterranean. It was invaded by everybody. But that's not Middle Eastern. Not really. So you wouldn't say Sofia Petrillo from the Golden Girls was, you know, Middle Eastern. Except she was actually Jewish in real life. Estelle Getty? Yes, I know Estelle Getty was Jewish. Rest in peace! I'm just saying. Here we go. Nancy's got me sweating like a dog out here. God forbid she gets a question right. Subjective round. Here's the question. Which is the best Ryan? A, Seacrest. B, Reynolds. C, Gosling. D, O'Neill. Think about me. God, those teeth. You're looking angry. I'm just going to say Gosling. Nancy? Yes? You win! You got it! It's Gosling! He makes interesting choices! I like Ryan Reynolds, but he should not have done the Green Lantern. Too pretty. That, exactly! Too pretty for a superhero. Every time one of these dudes gets successful, they're like, I want to play a big macho superhero now. They shouldn't. The Green Lantern, please. Fried green tomatoes, maybe. Not the Green Lantern.
Gosling is a great actor. He does indie films, big movies, and he's always good. You win $100! Hey! With your teeth and the hair and everything. It all worked out. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Have a good day, Nancy. <laughs> Safe. What? <laughs> what are you talking about? Why do you let him drag you away? Yes, there you go, you win! What? Where are you going? Come with me! Hey guys, it's Billy. I'm out here on the corner of Waverly and Green in the village of New York City, about to play my new favorite game. Is this a real Tyler the Creator lyric or not? What's your name, sir? I'm Caleb. Hi. Caleb, and where are you from? Pennsylvania. And do you live in New York now? Yes, I do. And what do you do here? I'm studying photography at NYU. Oh, wow. Yeah. And what's with the little American flag bandana? I really like America. That's awesome. OK, so we're going to play Is This a Real Tyler the Creator Lyric or Not? I'm going to read you a lyric, and you're going to tell me if it's a real Tyler the Creator Lyric or not by saying real or fake. Do you understand? Yes. OK, Tyler the Creator is one of the hottest rappers in the game right now, and he won the 2011 Video Music Award for Best New Artist. Here we go. For everyone you get right, you get $2. If you get them all right, you win a big prize. You ready, Caleb? Yes, I am. Okay, here we go. Is this a real Tyler the Creator lyric or not? Number one, I'm a fucking walking paradox. Threesomes with a fucking triceratops. Real. Yes, correct. That's $2. Number two, I'll crash that fucking airplane that that faggot nigga Bob is in and stab Bruno Mars in his goddamn esophagus. Fake. No, that's real. Oh next, next one, number three. I respect everyone. For example, gay people are human beings too, just like me. Real. No, that's fake. Number four, you silly rabbit faggot. Tricks are for kids, so we go abracadabra. Real. Yes, that's correct. You win four dollars. Yay. Yes, thanks, Caleb. Let's count it off. One, two, three, four dollars. There you go. Yeah, awesome. Yes, Thank that's, you so that's much. for America. God bless America. OK, thanks, Caleb. Thank you. Bye-bye. What are you going to spend it on? I don't know. Drugs? OK, perfect. All right, have a good day. Bye. Miss, miss, want to play the new Funny or Die game show? You can win real money right now. Ready to play? Yes, you can win real money on the street. Yes, play it right now. What's let's your play, name? Let's play, let's play. What's your name? Adele. Adele? Yes. Oh, like the singer. No. What? I've got a grab on my first date. What? What are you talking about? Why do you let him drag you away? What's your name? Rob. 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 OK, here. This is going to be fun. Ready? Here we go. All right, let's just let Rob stay no, no, over there. Rob, no, come here. back. Adele, do it by yourself, OK, no, no, for no, once. No, we're a, joint, we're a joint package. What? A joint package. Rob, turn around. Don't make my life difficult. Yes, yes. yes. OK? Right. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. New Funny or Die game. You can win real money right now. If you get two questions wrong in the first two rounds, you're out. If you need help answering a question, you can beg a stranger twice or I can call a woman. Ready to play? Ready. Ready. OK. Mm. Yes, He's a lot sorry, of fun. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. All right, all right, all right. Is your real name Adele? Yes! OK, great. Here we go, Adele. Round one, question one. On the hit television show The Big C, what does the C stand for? A, Canada. B, cancer. C, not really a comedy. D, camel toe. E, can't watch this at all. Canada. Is that your final answer? Cancer. Which is your answer? Answer. Correct, Rob! There you go, you see? That's the way to play that's the game. Why, that's why I'm here. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> Rob loves Laura Linney, don't you, Rob? I, I'm a big fan. Yeah. OK, here we go. Question two. She, what? I don't know who she is, actually. <laughs> go ahead. I just, you don't know who Laura Linney is? No. Goodbye. We're done here. I can't take this. Goodbye. Hey, guys, I've got cash in hand, and I'm ready to give it away if I can find anyone in this town who knows a damn thing. Let's go. Miss, for a dollar, true or false, Celine Dion is 65% bird. False. No, true. Miss, for a dollar, name three movies that don't exist. Go. Uh, the Yellow Brick House. Correct. Um, the House with Five Steps. Correct. And The Big Street Sign. Yes, there you go, you win. Yes. 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 Thank you for playing. Sir, someone loves envelopes. Who do you like better, Taylor Swift or Kelly Clarkson? I'm Kelly Clarkson. Yes, you win! There you go. Sir, little gay, little gay. Which makes more sense, Tory Spelling or a crop circle? A crop circle. Here you go, there you go. Congratulations. Thank you. OK, you're welcome, little gay. Any thoughts on Lady Gaga? I'd like to see her perform once in jeans. Exactly. Yes. It's too much. Yes. It's trying too hard. Yes. She's like, oh, here, here's a mailbox. I'll, I'll put this on my head. That's not, she's like, oh, I'm a genius. That's not genius. Hey, you walk by a mailbox. OK. What? Where are you going? Come with me. No, come with me. No, come with me. I need you. Come with me, please. Miss, 
Miss Rooney Mara. Rooney Mara. I don't know what that means. From the girl with the dragon tattoo. I have no idea. She's the dragon tattoo girl. No, never. She has it. She has a tattoo. Miss, for a dollar, who's better, Elton John or Elton from Clueless? Elton John. Yes, here you go. Woo! Woo! Sir, sir, Rooney Mara. Hi. Rooney Mara. Yes. The girl with the dragon tattoo. Yes. Are you going to see it? Uh, maybe, perhaps. I haven't read the book, though. What? I, I, I have not read it. It's one of the biggest movies of the year. Uh, no, I'll probably see it. You have to. I, I will, OK. She's very attractive. All right, I will see it. We bought a zoo. OK. With Scarlett Johansson. I don't know. I'm not familiar. Oh my God. That. New Cameron Crowe. I'm not familiar. I don't we know. We bought a zoo. I, I don't. Uh, oh, my God. That was weird. He's making dreams come true.